Hi, and welcome back to the next video. This is all about monetizing hot trends. Right, one quick and easy way to monetize on hot trend is to see the top hot searches in hot trends. And today, if you take a look at hot searches, these are the hot searches at the moment. You can see this one's for Biggest Loser winner. Um, this must be some kind of American competition because it's um, trending for the United States but I'm just looking for the one that I looked at previously I think it was Saturday right let's go back right yeah it was Thursday actually so Thursday 14th of March <coughs> now you can see Galaxy the Samsung people you know released some information about the new S4 that was coming out so at that moment that was really really a hot search you can see here with a half a million plus searches and also some related searches which was Samsung Galaxy S4, Samsung, Samsung S4 and S4 so what I'm going to do is actually just save those in a little text file for the moment because we need these in a, later, in a little bit later <coughs> So what we're going to do now is we're going to go back to the actual exploring of the trends and what we're going to do is type in Galaxy S4 and do a search on that. Now here you can see look, obviously there's no uh, trending topics or interest around it because obviously that phone didn't exist then but you can see the spike this uh, month in March because obviously they, they were talking about it Samsung told us all about the new features it was going to be <coughs> and you can see also the places where it was trending now you can see the spike and the interest in this phone now one easy way to jump on the traffic for this phone is to go out and find a good keyword domain for the search now you have to remember this domain is only really worth anything to you for a short period of time you know while there's buzz around the phone the make the model or the niche the product whichever you're looking at now there's really two ways to do this number one is to find a domain around the keywords fill it with content and look for a quick hit of traffic you know while the trend is going on now the second way to do this which is the one I prefer is to make a blog around a general hot trends for example, if you use the Galaxy as far as a example, you could just do a blog around the latest phones. Every time there's one out, a hot trend around new, a new phone, it all you know, create posts and content around it. So, I mean, if we look back at different phones over the last two years, the iPhone, Galaxy, and others, you can quickly see there's you know lots of trends that quickly push a traffic to a blog site about the latest phones. For example, if we go back and look at iPhone you can see obviously you know the rise in search uh, volume and interest you can also see the peaks and obviously these were probably uh, if that was the iPhone 4s iPhone 4 that was Apple unveiling the new iPhone that would probably have been the iPhone 5 yep there you go so you can see the peaks and you know as you can see it's quite a good nice steady rise in traffic now if you go look at blackberry which not so long ago is quite popular but it seems to be falling off a lot now you can see it's pretty steady rise in uh, interest you know this is all when smartphones came out you could probably there'll be different ones you know unveils a blackberry torch um, launches new battery bold and blackberry torch that's new blackberry's delay darkens rims future and this was rim is betting on the house of blackberry 10 so you can see obviously blackberry as a phone is not as popular as it was in 2011-2010 you know because all the other smartphones have come out since then now let's have a look at another one um, Let's just look at Galaxy itself. <coughs> now you can see this is it's pretty steady rise, but you know the really peak in these last couple of years. Obviously, it's catching up with the high, the iPhone in popularity. Now, 
rather than just making an individual blog about each phone what you could do is like make a blog about all smartphones like phones on to the to be released on hot topics and hot trends about them now obviously I mean Samsung have quite a good range of phones out so you could actually just make a blog about Samsung phones because there's you know there's new ones coming out all the time <coughs> information about them uh, accessories for them lots of different things so you could you know you could just make a blog just about the Samsung phones so what we need to do is now to go find a decent domain that we can use obviously we can't use Samsung in the actual name because it's going to be copyrighted so you know I mean, you can do it if you wish but you've got a very good chance of losing your blog if it's you know starts to gain any kind of traffic so what we're going to do is we're going to take these keywords these related teams and go across to Google AdWords and see what kind of domains see what information we can find out about them so what I need to do is take all those keywords paste them into word or phrase here you can see they're all down there and what I need to do is a phrase search do a quick search on that oh no in fact sorry we'll take off United Kingdom do locations of all I need to do across go to keyword ideas so you can see the most popular term is Galaxy S well just except for Galaxy S3 but you know 13,600 global monthly searches so a lot of traffic now <clears throat> it's going to be very very hard to rank for just Galaxy S so what we need to do is need to think around if you come to buy a new phone what's the first thing you do you compare it to another model you look at the reviews you look at the specs and accessories that you can get with it <clears throat> So what we need to do is, for example, we could take the keyword Galaxy S. And we could put on review. We could put on specs. Put on compare. search around that and what we need to do is we need to find a domain name that fits let's have a look down So what we need to do is we need to look through the different keyword ideas that it's given us, see if we can think of something that would fit in nicely. Um, Galaxy 4G review. You want something that's quite generic as well, but also <coughs> has some good monthly uh, searches. New Galaxy S. Go across to Instant Domain Search. You can start looking at a few of these different domains, <coughs> see if they're available. Uh, right, so we don't want anything with Samsung in the name at all. It might have been better to do. Galaxy S update.
In fact, let's, let's take a look at this one. Update Galaxy S. A minute, has <coughs> 9,900 global monthly searches. So if this is available, it probably won't. But right now, that's a really good domain name. Update Galaxy S. Now, obviously, people's going to be searching for updates because obviously they want the latest phones that is a good global monthly searches of 9900 <coughs> Galaxy S will fit all the different models the 3, the 4, the 5 also the, the ones will come on the the Samsung phones you'll probably pull search traffic in for those so that's quite a good domain name there it's available it's got 9900 searches and it would be very very easy to build a blog just featuring galaxy domains all around that uh, galaxy phones all around that domain so what what did the next point of call for a, a building a site like that well we need to find content so to find content for this type of products it's really easy you can quickly find out all the specs for the different samsung phones by quickly search it on Google. Now I'm not suggesting copying content but the specs are the same so you can put these into your own words. It's also very easy to find someone who has an older model for example the S2 or S3 and get them to give a review on that model. Now I know lots of my friends who have um, older phones S2s S3s and you know they'd easy give me <coughs> a little bit of a review about it so it's quite unique content. I mean, you can even buy reviews from Fiverr if you go across to Fiverr.com and just type in review on phone. I found I found one for five dollars. Uh, just type reviews. Review mobile phone. Just wait for it to load. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, this was one here. I will give it a review. Any cell phone as owner of a all big brands in the past and do my first time eight is just to judge and recommend a good phone. So you got a nice bit of unique content there for five dollars. So <clears throat> once you've got the content, you've got a good domain, just need a few products to sell. Now the easiest place to find the products to sell is across Amazon. You'll find lots and lots of products for the Galaxy phones. You've got accessories. Let's uh, just let's look for the Galaxy. You've got the phones. You've got the accessories. Um, cards you got you, you know it's so many things that you could put on there that you could sell on the <coughs> on your blog on your site all you need to do is join the Amazon affiliate account you know, it doesn't pay very much but you know it's uh, it's what people's going to be looking for I myself just I just bought the new Galaxy Note 2 and the first thing I did I looked on Amazon for um, <coughs> different products for it now if you can pull that traffic from your domain from the Google you know for direct from the search it's going to be much better and obviously you know you're going to make quite a bit of money on those upsells and affiliate orders now you can also offer there's lots of different mobile shops online shops that actually have affiliate programs you can actually sell the handsets there's some in the UK <coughs> I've put some in the ebook and you can actually recommend different ones and I can get paid about 30 pounds 40 dollars 
per handset per subscription so there's lots of things you could add on to that kind of mobile phone blog but I mean it doesn't just work with mobile phones you can do it around any kind of hot trend that you can find on uh, Google Hot Trends and you can target it to different products different niches so uh, next video is all about Google Trends and Domains so I'll leave it there and I'll see you in the next video